Chuck Gaylord, Meyer Supply, technical trainer for the LG VRF product. Today we're going to review the auto address procedure. Now this procedure has to be done at startup and what, what the process is, the outdoor unit establishes communication with the indoor unit. It brings in all of the indoor unit information, the number, the capacity, and, and all those parameters that go along with those indoor units. Collects all that information, stores it at the outdoor. So that process, to, to do that process, we need to go ahead and hit the red button on the outdoor main PC board and you'll see an 88 display on the board. So that process, everything has to be powered up. Nothing can be calling. None of your indoor units can be calling for heating or cooling and all of, obviously all your power supplies have to be intact. And if we're doing a heat recovery system, your HR boxes have to be configured at that point. So on this system, we're gonna hold that red button, red button here for three to five seconds, 88 will display. Now this part of it takes uh, three to five minutes and Right now, we know the process is going on because of the 88, and when, when it gets done, it's gonna show me the number of indoor units, then it'll tell me the number of HR boxes. So on, on the heat recovery system, this would be your, your last resort for troubleshooting a communication error. On a heat pump system, because there is no uh, auto pipe detect, which in a later video, we'll go over the auto pipe process, but in a heat pump system, a two pipe system, we can just press that red button. It'll go out, reach out to the indoor units, find that information and bring it back in. So now we're just waiting for this heat recovery system to establish communication. So again, 88 is on. We know the process is going through and now it's just a waiting process. During this auto address process, 88 will stay on the screen until it shows us the correct number of indoor units and the correct number of HR boxes. If those two numbers are correct for the system that you've, you're working on, then you know the auto address has, has correctly uh, found all of your indoor units and then you'll hit the reset button, the gray button right next to the red uh, button here on the main PC board. The 88, goes off, it'll show you the first, the indoors, and then the HR boxes. On this particular system, those numbers will only be there for about 20 seconds. It'll show you the number of indoors, the HR box, and then it'll disappear and go blank. On the newer product, it'll stay there longer, the Multi-V5, it won't disappear. But on this older generation Multi-V4, you've got to pay attention. So, so we've got we had eight, and now we have two for our HR boxes. We know we successfully passed the auto address, and now we're going to go ahead and hit the reset button, and we can move to the next process.